before we start with the video, let me introduce myself. I am Ima and I am a college student here in Korea. I actually flew here over a month ago and I was supposed to post videos last month but I got pretty busy with some certain travel requirements, school activities, and our finals. But it's finally our summer break and I will start posting more videos soon. I hopefully get to use this channel as a way to document my life here in Korea as an international student and share my experiences. So I hope you like my vlog and subscribe to my channel for more videos. This vlog is probably going to be full of voiceovers and clips of me butting in because I barely vlogged my first month in Korea but aside from that yeah um, I hope you guys enjoy the rest of the vlog I don't want to burden you till I feel right as rain right as rain but just know you keep my heart keep my heart keep my heart beating you give me more give me more give me more to believe in you know one day i will find a way to feel something just keep my heart keep my heart keep my heart beating when i break it down one pill at a time i hate to feel that you're showing me that i'm not broken just trying and hide But now you I hate to dwell On all the expectations I know I get Too much and too soon Yeah, I don't want to Overwhelm you Cause I'm the reddest rain Reddest rain But just know You keep my heart, you keep my heart You keep my heart beating You keep me more, you keep me more you keep me more than I Okay, so some of you might be curious about the requirements for traveling to Korea. So I will list everything you need and must do. So first, if you're like me and you're from the Philippines, you will need a visa. Okay, now this is for everyone. You will need a negative PCR test result taken within 48 hours or a rapid antigen test taken within 24 hours and then the third one is quarantine is not required anymore but you have to create your own QR code that they will check once you get off the plane you, what you can do is um, just search for Q code online, Q dash code, Korea, and then it will pop up right away. And I will also leave the link down below if you need. So, next is taking the PCR test when you arrive in Korea. So, you have to take it on the 6th to 7th day of your arrival. I took mine within 24 hours and then a rapid antigen test on the 6th to 7th day 
of my arrival because that was what they required back then but um, their policies changed and it might keep on changing so I recommend that you check it out for yourself as well also you don't have to worry because they will give you a manual slash flyer in the airport and everything that you need to do in Korea is in there so I'm not sure now but whatever they give in the airport just read it because it's probably very very important um here's a picture of the manual that they gave me in the airport And I don't love the way you treat me when you stoop In a perfect world you take me as I do And I'm ashamed to say you pay for all my dues mm -mm. I still got love for you Been a couple days since I ran it back I'm finally here I'm sweating Eyes wide but open there. when you lay down <sighs> Try to build me up, I stay down. I survived. Who am I? 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 I don't love the way you treat me 